Alright, so in this video, I'm gonna be going to do 10 big details about FIFA 18. If you guys wanna see me do like a 20 big details about FIFA 18, let's go for 2,500 likes in 3 hours on this video, and I'll make sure to get that video up this week. Anyway, enjoy the video for now, and let's get into the first detail right away. So this is a screenshot from the FIFA 18 journey trailer, and as you guys can see, it says once to watch, which is awesome, so that is most likely gonna be coming back an Ultimate Team, and it also says right there that, uh, you know, there's gonna be a new kit revealed, and uh, it, 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 most likely this is an easter egg for for ultimate team and we're most likely going to be getting that kick ass on the game which is awesome it looks great so let me know what you guys think about this kit down below in the comments but i think we'll get this kit right here on fifa ultimate team uh, when that comes out we also have some more information about fifa 18 the journey and uh, as you guys can see there's going to be more customization this year including hairstyles uh, tattoos and clothing that is you know very awesome because that can make um you know alex hunter pretty much you know very unique for every single one that plays the journey and uh, yeah there's new playable characters there's local multiplayer which is also really awesome you can actually play with uh, you know your friend or something he can be another character while you are I think Alexander or something and um, sync chapter is very awesome a bigger world of football to play in so this looks awesome let me know if you guys are excited about the journey in the comments here we also have some more leaked icons on FIFA 18 I'm not too sure if this is real or not but loads of people have been talking about this image on Twitter so I do need to think that it's really it looks very realistic and as you guys can see here we have the stats and everything let me know in the comment section down below if you guys agree with these stats or not and uh, yeah just uh, you know, it looks amazing. I mean, I would love these cards to be on the game next year. We'll have to wait and see, though. I think we're going to get some more information about this in a few days. So I'll update you guys when we get some more icons uh, released to the game. But yeah, there we go. Let me know what you guys think about them down below. Last night, I made a couple FIFA 18 journey videos. Make sure you guys go and check them out if you haven't seen it already. Because I just, uh, you know, talked about some new things you might have missed in, uh, you know, the trailers and stuff. And as you can see there in the background, Alex Sancho does need to sign for Real Madrid. Which means that, you know, you'll be able to play in more leagues and stuff. Which is going to be awesome. So there we go. Just a nice detail if you guys missed it. But yeah, make sure you guys go and check out the journey videos I posted last night. So this is the official FIFA 18 demo, guys. And as you can see right here, we also have the demo teams. And you can also play the journey, uh, you know, a little bit of it on FIFA 18, the demo. So that's going to be great. I'll be trying out the journey, of course. But at the same time, I'm also going to be trying out a few games. And uh, yeah, there we have the clubs right there, guys. Manchester United, PSG. And yeah, let me know if you guys, uh, you know, like these uh, clubs right there on the, on the demo. And if you guys are going to be playing the journey as well uh, when the demo comes out. There is also new celebrations on the game. This is the Mannequin Challenge celebration by Jamie Varney. I think he also did this actually in the game, um, you know, this year. So that's pretty awesome right there. Then we also have the celebration by Ronaldo. I just know that he did this one as well at some point. I'm not too sure what it's called, but yeah, there is a few celebrations. I suppose we'll just have to wait until the demo to try the ball out. But uh, there we go, two of the new celebrations right there. Back on FIFA 14 when the World Cup was going on, we got a World Cup game mode on Ultimate Team, which means that you can open packs and, you know, just uh, pretty much go ahead and build your squads um, you know, with the World Cup cards and stuff. It was really awesome. This will be returning guys for FIFA 18, which is going to be amazing. I cannot wait to see the FIFA 18 and uh, World Cup mode on the Ultimate Team and everything. It's going to be awesome. Here we also have some new gameplay features. Not too big, but you know, still some details that I do indeed like. As you guys can see, one of my favorites is this on pitch debris, which means that, you know, there's going to be like toilet paper on the pitch. Like, you know, usually there's a few things ending up on the pitch, um, you know, in, in different games and stuff. So, like, the stadiums are much better, much more detailed. It just looks amazing guys if you go over to twitter right now you can actually see like a leaked gameplay from the demo like you can just see the debris on the page it just looks awesome so let me know what you guys think about this down below i do indeed like this a lot guys and that is that fifa 18 will also be released on nintendo switch which is really cool because i remember i don't think it's actually been on nintendo in a few years right now and of course when it was on nintendo wii a few years ago it was just terrible like it didn't have ultimate team didn't have nothing at all but on fifa 18 on nintendo switch it's actually gonna have ultimate team as well so you can actually play ultimate team and you know the gameplay actually looks pretty good so uh, yeah if you guys have a nintendo switch i'd recommend picking up fifa 18 it looks really interesting and uh yeah just uh, a new feature guys on nintendo switch I was talking about the stadiums looking much better guys this year and as you can see we have like you know some club banners right here we even have the coca-cola can there which we found on FIFA 17 that still will be on FIFA 18 and the thing is guys like uh, from the gameplay you're actually gonna be able to see that car right there and that coca-cola can when you actually play the game like in game as I said the details around the stadium like the, there's so much more detail guys this year from the stadiums when you actually play um, you know the gameplay in game it looks amazing you're be seeing much more of it it just looks awesome i would just recommend you guys to go over to twitter search up fifa 18 leaked demo gameplay or something because it just looks awesome you'll be able to see that car and that coca-cola can in game and just a lot more detail uh, from around the stadium from club to club 